Monseigneur, His Eminence Cardinal Piaggi. Ah, Louis, come in. Your timing is impeccable. I wanted to have a word with you. Oh, here we go. I was wondering how you are getting on in your search for our poor Sarah. You must have made some progress, I should think. I am terribly worried about her, you know. Come on, get out of here, Louis. You're in a hurry. Any news of her? I don't know why, Your Eminence, but I get the impression you're asking a question to which you already know the answer. Let's say I have heard rumors, but I prefer to ask you the question directly. Well, what have you heard exactly? It would appear that your mother is implicated in the death of the Duchess's twin sister, and that as she tried to escape, apparently von Volner heroically interposed, but after a fierce struggle, Sarah knocked him out. My mother? And Volner? Fighting like two cats in a bag? You do recall that my mother is an old lady, Your Eminence, and yet you believe such hogwash? <laughs> I'm surprised at you. I'm only telling you what people are saying, Louis. I never said that. I believed it. Oh, what a story, all the same. Twins! I was always wary of the Duchess anyway. I did not appreciate the facility with which she would flaunt her assets. You know, Louis, I don't want to put you on the spot, but I sense you are worried and that you are not telling me everything. What exactly did you come looking for in my room? What do you mean? Louis, I was not born yesterday, you know. When you came in, I saw in your face a hint of disappointment at finding me here. I concluded that you were hoping you wouldn't run into me. You came here for something else. I'm looking for a cross, Your Eminence, so I thought you might be able to help me. You are asking me for a crucifix? You wouldn't want St. Benedict, would you? Oh, it's a cross that's commonly used for exorcisms, isn't it? What does he imagine I'm preparing for, for crying out loud? No, no, I'm, I'm looking for one of the crosses of Clement III. Ah, very well. Luck! I do indeed have one. Oh, do you think you could lend it to me for a few hours, please? Uh, first, though, you'll have to answer a few questions, my dear fellow. It's win-win. Well, I thought you were more charitable, Father. Charity begins at home, Louis. Actually, it's quite simple. You want my cross, and I want some answers. I think we ought to get on fine, don't you? I need that cross. I must not speak to him about my mother at all costs. What exactly are you involved in, Louis? Your Eminence, I'm hardly going to teach you the rules. If you were supposed to know how I spend my days, you would already know, don't you think? Someone would have let you in on the secret. Yes, I know, but you know what that means. Uh, that I am not supposed to know? Ever since your arrival, I've seen you rushing about all over the place, uh, apparently trying to find Sarah. Uh, we both know how big this island is. Even if Sarah was disguised as a bush, she would not be able to escape our vigilance for long. You must have already found her. She needs help, Louis. We are friends, she and I. Won't you just tell me where she is? Your Eminence, if I were sure that you were not asking me all these questions with the sole intention of passing on my answers to the others, then I would be able to answer you. 
Oh, Louis. How can you doubt my integrity? Can you swear to God that you will not reveal to Lord Mortimer or Sir Gregory where my mother is located? Well, that all depends on your revelations, Louis. You see, Sir Gregory and myself are... Promise me before God. Wait, no, I... Promise before God or I will tell you nothing. Louis, don't... Drop it, your eminence. We are unable to reach an understanding. Just never mind. Louis, tell me at least why you want the Clement the Third Cross. I am sure that you are aware that this is the cross that Lord Mortimer gave to me when we first met. That was the day I decided to take the cloth. It cannot be a coincidence. Please, I beg you, why the cross of Pope Clement? Eminence, I sense that evil is rampant in these parts. Help me. I need protection. Please let me have the cross. I beseech you. Of course, my son. Do not fear. It will give you protection. Never will I leave a true believer in such depravity. Louis, thank you for trusting me. I shall not forget it. You can take my cross. Here. But please return it to me once you have finished with it. Thank you. Thank you, Your Eminence. You're a lifesaver. I have no time to lose, so I might as well not bother him. 